Hello, I'm going to read you a story today called The Otter Who Loved to Hold Hands. And I brought Gerald with me today because he likes listening to stories as everybody in clarinets and flutes know. And this is Little Otter, who the story is all about. Every night when they go to sleep, Otto's family hold hands so they don't drift apart and every morning when they wake up, they all let go again, except for little Otto. Otto worried about swimming, he worried about diving and he worried about getting lost. But most of all, he worried about being alone. Every morning, Mum said, please let go, Otto. I can't do anything with you holding my hand. But Otto shook his head. He didn't want to let go. I can't swim on my own, he squealed, clinging onto Mum. He knew he would float, but letting go was still scary. What if he drifted out to sea? You can do it, Mum said gently. But Otto shook his head. He didn't want to let go. The other cubs enjoyed playing, chasing and splashing. Otto wanted to join in, but he just couldn't let go of Mum and Dad. Go and play, said Dad. I'll watch you from here. But Otto shook his head. He didn't want to let go. I'm scared, Otto cried. Don't let go, Otto begged as Mum tried to open an oyster shell. I'm still right here, Mum sighed, but Otto just had to hold on. Mum and the shell bobbed and rocked as Otto clung to her. When Mum finally opened the oyster shell, Otto saw a beautiful shiny pearl gleaming inside it. It's amazing, Otto said. Oh, look, there's an otter inside, just like me. Otto reached out to the little otter in the pearl and before he knew it, he was holding the beautiful pearl in both his hands. Otto saw a happy otter floating all by himself and realised it was him. of you mum said well done Otto dad said I let go Otto cried I'm floating on my own and I'm fine hooray come and play with us called the other little otters so now every day Otto splashes and swims and plays with his friends he's a very happy little otter but he still looks forward to night time when he and his family hold hands as they drift off to sleep. And that's the end. I hope you enjoyed that story. Bye bye.